Not right, only I'm to back. the mines, but to the workings of the artifact they discovered in the depth. Alright. An optional mission. Dang. Oh, hey. Did we get a new line of inventory? Man, I have a lot of health things. that mean? Whoa! Holy crap! Let's take care of our main gun first, then, shall we? Damage and rate of fire. Doesn't actually give us any benefit. Extra reloads decent. expecting to get. Yeah, why not? Let's see, anything super weak. Reloading clip. Or sorry, rate of firing clip. Extra reload. more damage. Sure. 
All right, awesome. There isn't like. I can't actually construct those. Wow! That is awesome. Okay. Even stronger guns. Any reason to check the suit's kiosk? No. Does it even make sense that they have this down here? Are you kidding me? That's a regenerator. He was shivering, naked when I found him. The self-inflicted wounds carved deep into his skin. The meaning of which I can only speculate. I had to work to pry the artifact from his cold, white hand. A curious object made of an unknown material activated, it seems, by sound. The markings are words that I'm sure of, but without a means of translating them, I'm afraid its purpose will remain a mystery. Mm. If only there were more time, I could find other examples of the script stored here and unlock it. The deep dig survivors refuse to speak. Whether this is willing or the result of trauma they observed is uncertain, they continue to draw strange symbols on any surface they can find. When no surface is available, they use their own skin. After persistent inquiries as to what they were doing, one of them finally turned to me and spoke. We witnessed the truth, he said, and so will you. This last bit he screamed as he came at me with a utility knife. Thankfully, I managed to scramble away. It took several soldiers to subdue him before he could be taken to a more secure holding area. Thought that was a regenerator. How is there zero gravity here?
when I first saw the city, I was amazed at um, this sanctuary. They're everywhere you look, clustered together, integrated into their architecture. It wasn't until I studied them more closely that I understood. They're not statues at all, but the remains of this once great species. Willing or not, they have become an integral part of the machine of staggering complexity. They're literally paid for the construction with their very lives. Oh, those are anti-gravity things? Looks like that's the case. Alright. Some artifacts were brought up for examination, covered in what I can only describe as fossilized carbon carbuncles. I'm not sure what that means. We thought they were inert, having been dead for potentially millions of years, but they were in anti-gravity transit. Some of the gross broke off when um, crews went back to retrieve them. They discovered several large pods fixed to the walls, presumably incubating something within. When approached, they cracked open. And what spilled out was horrifying. We lost several of our crew that day. The creatures have since been shut up in the transit shaft until we can examine them. The other shaft has been fitted with tripwire devices to determine or deter any others that may have escaped our notice. Oh. I see. down ones and then the double upside down.
All right. I was very confused as to where they were coming from for a second there. an alien. Did I forget to actually pause the timer? Oh, I'm gonna have to look at that. Awesome. Alright, hang on one second. I just want to do some quick math. Okay, so my timer is accurate. So we're just going to go a little bit further, and then we're going to uh, finish up this one. Final. Final. Huh. There has to be a reason they're giving me those.
slash the artifact. The signal produced by the marker um, preeminates everything and everyone. We are all affected differently. Some are driven to rage, others suffer hallucinations. Still others fall into um, gibbering dementia. But perhaps the most insidious effect it has is when we don't realize it has taken hold of us. Indeed, we show no outward signs of madness. We believe we are following our, nat our natural compulsions. And in all likelihood, we will not realize this manipulation until our ill-conceived plans come to fruition and it is too late to reverse our actions am i just am i justified in resisting the urge to turn off the machine am i right in believing the machine must be completed to stop the markers or am i a slave to the very forces that conspire to wipe out all life in the universe only life only time will tell Alright, time for one of these fun things. Upgrade circuit. Two damage, two clip. Ooh. That one's good. just two clip. Oh, well, that sucks. Not actually nearly as good as I thought it was. Anyways, I'm going to wrap this one up here. Next time, we're going to finish up this side mission, continue on with the main one. So anyways, I'll see all of you guys later. Bye!